OSHA 1926 Subpart G, Signs, Signals, and Barricades. OSHA 1926.200, Accident Prevention Signs and Tags. 1926.200, A, General. Signs and symbols required by this subpart shall be visible at all times when work is being performed, and shall be removed or covered promptly when the hazards no longer exist. 1926.200, B, Danger Signs. 1926.200, B, 1, Danger Signs shall be used only where an immediate hazard exists and shall follow the specifications illustrated in Figure 1 of ANSI Z35.1-1968 or in Figures 1-13 to of ANSI Z535.2-2011, incorporated by reference in Section 1926.6. 1926.200, B, 2, Danger Signs shall have red as the predominating color for the upper panel, black outline on the borders, and a white lower panel for additional sign wording. 1926.200, C, Caution Signs. 1926.200, C, 1, Caution Signs shall be used only to warn against potential hazards or to caution against unsafe practices, and shall follow the specifications illustrated in Figure 4 of ANSI Z35.1-1968 or in Figures 1-13 to of ANSI Z535.2-2011, incorporated by reference in Section 1926.6. 1926.200, C, 2, caution signs shall have yellow as the predominating color, black upper panel and borders, yellow lettering of caution on the black panel, and the lower yellow panel for additional sign wording. Black lettering shall be used for additional wording. 1926.200, C, 3, the standard color of the background shall be yellow, and the panel, black with yellow letters. Any letters used against the yellow background shall be black. The colors shall be those of opaque glossy samples as specified in Table 1 of ANSI Z53.1-1967 or in Table 1 of ANSI Z535.1-2006, or 2011, incorporated by reference in Section 1926.6. 1926.200, D, Exit Signs. Exit signs, when required, shall be lettered in legible red letters, not less than 6 inches high on a white field and the principal stroke of the letter shall be at least three-fourths inch in width. 1926.200, E, Safety Instruction Signs. Safety instruction signs, when used, shall be white with green upper panel with white letters to convey the principal message. Any additional wording on the sign shall be black letters on the white background. 1926.200, F, Directional Signs. Directional signs, other than automotive traffic signs specified in paragraph G of this section, shall be white with a black panel and a white directional symbol. Any additional wording on the sign shall be black letters on the white background. 1926.200 G, Traffic Control Signs and Devices. 1926.200 G, 1, At Points of Hazard. Construction areas shall be posted with legible traffic control signs and protected by traffic control devices. 1926.200, G, 2, the design and use of all traffic control devices, including signs, signals, markings, barricades, and other devices, for protection of construction workers shall conform to Part 6 of the MUTCD, incorporated by reference, see Section 1926.6. 1926.200, H, Accident Prevention Tags. 1926.200, H, 1, Accident Prevention Tags shall be used as a temporary means of warning employees of an existing hazard, such as defective tools, equipment, etc. They shall not be used in place of, or as a substitute for, accident prevention signs. 1926.200, H, 2, for Accident Prevention Tags. Employers shall follow specifications that are similar to those in Figures 1 to 4 of ANSI Z35.2-1968 or Figures 1 to 8 of ANSI Z535.5-2011, incorporated by reference in Section 1926.6. 1926.200 I. Additional Rules. ANSI Z35.1-1968, ANSI Z535.2-2011, ANSI Z35.2-1968, and ANSI Z535.5-2011, incorporated by reference in Section 1926.6,
contain rules in addition to those specifically prescribed in this subpart. The employer shall comply with ANSI Z35.1-1968 or ANSI Z535.2-2011 and ANSI Z35.2-1968 or Z535.5-2011 with respect to such additional rules. OSHA 1926.201, Signaling 1926.201, A, Flaggers Signaling by flaggers and the use of flaggers, including warning garments worn by flaggers, shall conform to Part 6 of the MUTCD, incorporated by reference, see Section 1926.6. 1926.201, B, Crane and Hoist Signals Regulations for crane and hoist signaling will be found in applicable American National Standards Institute Standards, 